B97, your home in South Central Indiana for the best in local music. Welcome to the show, hour number two. I am Kev, that is Steel. We got the guys and taken in in the studio with us, Kyle Blake right here. And uh, you guys, we were talking about the EP earlier, but I totally forgot to ask you, what's the name of the EP? Um, it's, it's, actually, it's actually called Through Shallow Waters. And where can you guys pick this up at, or where can the people at listening can pick this up? Mostly at shows, um, but I mean, if you get a hold of us on Facebook, uh, you know, we can do that too. So. What's, it, your, what's your Facebook page real quick? Uh, you know, before you interrupt! <laughs> Facebook.com slash Taken In Cool. And you guys are doing some iTunes stuff here coming up as well. Yeah. Are you gonna, are you gonna wait till you get the full length done and then throw it all on iTunes? Or? Um, no, actually we're gonna put a, uh, the new EP um, on iTunes. We actually had one song on iTunes earlier, but uh, it just came up on <laughs> They're a rock band. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I'm amazed, that, and it's it's funny that you guys you guys drove like how how far to get here? You guys are you guys live in Eminence now? Yeah, it's about an hour away. It's about 20 minutes for us to uh, And they showed up on time. To I was talking to Kyle uh, before the show, and he goes, "Oh man, we meant to be here a little bit earlier." I'm like, if you guys are a rock band, you guys should be showing up like 45 minutes late at least. <laughs> yeah, dude, and then and then tell me that you're early. I don't think <laughs> I've ever been on time for anything in my life. It's amazing. It's going to be a Anyway, okay, so tell us about uh, this uh, new song you guys have, Lost at the Y. You guys get like Lost at the YMCA once? <laughs> this is actually a really funny story. Um, um, we does that have to do with Michigan? No. No, 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 nothing no Michigan. <laughs> no Michigan. <laughs> um, our ex uh, guitar player um, was at my house and we're redoing our house and stuff and uh, there was paths actually in our house and um, so he was like where's the bathroom and I was like well just go to the Y and turn turn left and it was in complete darkness yeah. so uh, we wanted to make a song he's like I got lost at the Y in the, in the Black Abyss which our next song right after that on the EP is called Black Abyss. Nice. And it goes straight <laughs> into it. Yeah. You know, nice. So it's a song about getting lost going to the bathroom at your house. Yes. But that's, 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 actually... that's the inspiration of the title. This yes. is why oh, I awesome. love rock bands, dude. <laughs> Let's go ahead. You guys want to intro it? Yeah, uh, this song is called Lost at the Lock. On the show, B97. Let's take it in. Crank it. Three, two, one. B97, your home in South Central Indiana for the best in local music. Show. Good evening. I am Kev. That is Theo. We got the guys and taking in the studio with us, Kyle and Blake. And uh, guys, so I, I don't even know where I'm going to go with this. Do I do. You I've got anything? Yeah, I've got a quick question. Since you guys tour a lot, who's the coolest? Uh, I guess who's who's one of the bands that you guys have enjoyed the most playing with or uh, you know touring with or anything like that? Playing a show with? Well, we'll both say one. But my favorite is definitely Freshman Fifteen. They're from Atlanta, Georgia, and they are awesome. I mean. The, their vocals are just amazing. It sounds like almost like a girl because it's so cute and so hot. But things can get real low. Well. That's cool. Phenomenal drums, phenomenal guitar playing. Awesome harmonies. My favorite is Affiance. Oh. Uh, we played them in uh, Rachel's, Rachel's Cafe. Cafe. Yeah. Pretty good. A beautiful, yeah. a mixture of like heavy playing but also soft and good singing. Amazing. I'm, when I went there and watched it, I was so amazed with those guys. I love those. They have a video out. It's hilarious. You should go see it. Dude, you should. You should send me the uh, link. That's Very awesome. We'll put it on our Facebook, dude, before you guys leave. So. He's actually singing in his underwear the whole time. <laughs> that might Playing be a Kev. rock band. That might be Playing Kev. a rock band. <laughs> that's, that's Kev's normal, like, Monday afternoon is him singing in his underwear. Yeah, whatever, dude. You're the one who's not wearing any pants right now, so yeah, it's not. Sunday. All right. Let's get back to the music. Here's Protocol Subliminal Reality on b Seven, your home in South Central Indiana for the best in local music. It is the show. I am Kev, that is Theo, and we got the guys from taking in the studio with us, Kyle and Blake. Now, uh, guys, what are you laughing at? What are you laughing at? Are you, are you getting just, all embarrassed because there's a video camera on you? No, no, I'm just pointing at everybody, whatever it's you said you said. So. <laughs> uh, anyway, dude, uh, so here's, here's my question for you guys. If you guys had a chance to play with any band, any band in the entire world, who would it be? We got a popped collar over here from Blake. A day to remember. A day Definitely. to remember. Those, those guys are awesome. I saw them at Warped Tour. Like, so did we. Well, I hear you. Blake missed it. Where were I'm you, Blake? I'm a little upset about that. I was, um, you know, running the normal teenager life. I have no money. So, uh, 
I'm in a band, so any money that I get either goes to gas or band. Yeah, so band band funds. You know, believe it or not, drum stuff is actually pretty expensive. I don't oh, know dude. if anyone knows that. <laughs> yeah. Very expensive. Well, that's because you wreck it like after like three shows. You I know. I, I sort of get a little in too much into my music, and I occasionally will break ahead in some way. Okay, so so what we should do right now is we should do like a PSA for Blake. I wish I had some sad music. Da, 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 da. Like the Incredible Hulk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> My name is Blake. I play drums. <laughs> you should be saying this. You should be repeating this, dude. I'm Blake. Doesn't he look a little bit like yeah. Brett Lock? Brock Lesnar? Brock Lesnar. Brock Lesnar. <laughs> he does. He does. But, but that, don't tell the people that because that would totally kill it, you know? <laughs> yeah. we're, 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 we're trying to solicit money here, okay? Hi, I'm Blake. I play drums for taking it. If you would like to donate to my drum fund, Here's my PayPal account. <laughs> Here is my PayPal account. <laughs> roses are not accepted. No, no roses. And all the money will go to work to it. Panties, yes. <laughs> Panties are accepted. <laughs> all right, let's get back to the music. Apollo Quads coming up next right here on B97. B97, your home in South Central Indiana for the best. In the local music, it is the show. I am Kev, that's Steel, and uh, we got the guys who are taking in Kyle and Blake here. Woo, woo, woo. What the heck is that? That is uh, a band call. A band call? Yes. So I can just go around and start start yelling that in random places, and I will hear that back at me. Oh, if, yeah, if they know it, if they know it. You, I've done it to some random people, and they were uh, they backed away from me. <laughs> <laughs> You're either going to yeah. get hauled out of Sam's Club or you're going to hear like three people yell at Sam's Club. <laughs> it's the um, taken in bat sign. You guys, yes. the bat signal. you guys totally have to make a shirt with that. Like, right there. Yeah, that'd be awesome. Anyway, uh, speaking of which, you guys are actually looking for a bass player right now, correct? Yes. Do they have to have the band sign down by the time that uh, they come in and audition or something? Um, well, I... <laughs> <laughs> the rules... That would be funny, but... <laughs> the rules and uh, this, this is the, uh... The essentials to becoming a bass player in a band taken in. One, you must like a day to remember. Two, you must have a license. Yes. And three, you must like Jack Daniels. And also, you have to be at least 18. And at least 18. Get, you gotta get in bars. Yeah, you gotta be at least 18 at least and 18. like Jack. So, I mean, that, that all voice You have out. to scream, too. Screams, and, yeah, screams are a plus. Yes. That's cool. Very Obviously. cool. So, that'd be awesome. The only one you can audition, man. <laughs> yeah, right? You, you want me to audition? Yeah, I Holy man, mm. I can play. I can play a mean ukulele. So if you guys ever like, sweet. You guys are. Yes. You guys are in the market I for a Hawaiian guy player. In a grand player, player. got him. A <laughs> reggae stuff will call you. Right we'll on. Call you. Right on. Let's get back to the music now. Oh wait, wait. Before we get back to the music, let's go back to the bass player. Thing. So if uh, someone would like to audition for to be a bass player for Taken In, who do they contact and how do they contact? You, um, you can contact me, Kyle. Um, you can go on Facebook, you can uh, you know, go to our Facebook, like us, and then, uh, <laughs> what, if, what if they vote you down and then want to audition? <laughs> no, we don't, we don't like them, <laughs> yeah, well, but we want to be in the room. Um, but yeah, just contact us through there, um, our page owners are on the left, so okay. uh, just contact us through there. And look for the name Kai, and tell them that you are an awesome, awesome basis to you can drive a band and scream. <laughs> or you can go to Walmart and scream the uh, band sign and see oh, if they're there. Do it again. That, that, put that in the subject line. That way we know you are for <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's get back to the music. Here's Straight No Chaser at B97. B97, your home in South Central Indiana for the best in local music. It is the show. I am Kev. That is Steel. We got the guys and taking it in the studio with us, Kyle and Blake. And, uh,. Why? What's this possum thing that you guys are talking about? Well, one night, me, Kyle, and our old bassist, Levi, we were going up to Louisville, a, a town right by us, and we're going up the road, and here comes a possum crossing the way, and I guess we hit it, on and accident. so, on accident, not trying to hate on animals, <laughs> yeah. the first time. We go, yeah, yeah. I'm all hater. <laughs> there, so goes our, there goes our Peter, Peter sponsorship. Yeah. <laughs> So I grabbed a chain out of the van and I started whacking the possum like it eight <laughs> times in the head. Because we wanted to get it out of yeah, his Yeah, he's out. twitching and stuff. So, well, I guess I still could not kill it. So Kyle runs it back over with the van. Oh, wow. And then when we turn around, it's still twitching. So me and Levi roll the window down and open the door. 
in five miles per hour run over its head and that gruesome sound of its head popping and the brain popping out, yeah. me and Levi threw up on the spot. Nice. It's it's more of a mixture of I don't really know, just go run a possum's head over it. There's no words you can just yeah. describe that sound. I mean, I really hate possums, but I felt really bad for this possum. Yes, we did feel bad, though. We we're just trying to put out his misery. But we I doing feel bad for job. this possum, dude. <laughs> you, when, you're, when you're describing that story, the, the image that I got in my head was, uh, what was it, Tommy Boy? Was it Tommy Boy? <laughs> or was it, was it Black Sheep? The one where they, uh, they get the uh, deer. Where they hit the deer. Oh, oh, that, oh, and they put him back in the car. And they put him in the seat. And, and then wake him up. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, anyway, we'll chat more with the guys taking in coming up next. And we'll, they might have some more stories of hating on possums. <laughs> <laughs> Jack Christie's going up next year if he looks at Seven, your home in South Central Indiana for the best in local music. It is the show. I am Kev. That is Theo. We got uh, some special guests in the studio. Uh, actually, the guys you just heard taken in here. Um, Kyle and Blake. The song's called "My Calling," by the way, which is phenomenal. That song. That song makes me have seizures. It's so awesome. Thank you very much. Uh, <laughs> that song's actually about a a girl that I absolutely love. Um, her name's Lindsay Gray, and uh, she's from Nobleville, and I met her back at church for a long time, and I decided to write a song about her. Nice. That's what it's about. I love Lindsay, too. <laughs> I love you, Lindsay. Oh, is, it, is that her over there? No. No. <laughs> no. No, I'm kidding. That's his girlfriend. I'm kidding. Awkward! <laughs> yes, <laughs> Awkward! I heard, I heard men love and then <laughs> did it <laughs> uh, Moving on. So, anyway, guys, so if someone wants to uh, pick up some taken in material, whether, whether it be merch, whether it be songs, EPs, where can they go? Well, um, most of our stuff is sold at shows for right now. Um, we're working on getting some stuff on, uh, online so we can you know, buy it online, and stuff, uh, which will probably be up in the next probably six months after we get some new merchandise. After we get some more gigs to get to make it. But um, quit blowing your quit blowing your cash on warp tour tickets. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. So you guys have both EPs online as well. Mm -hmm. And then you can buy those or you know buy them at the show or through Facebook or anything like that. And uh, I guess an another question I guess um, once you guys do the LP that'll be online as well. Yeah. I'm, t I'm guessing the entire LP you guys yeah, are definitely. you guys are looking to do the iTunes again as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're probably going to do actually the iTunes for the new EP with uh, Three Shadow Waters. Mm -hmm. That'll be on that, and maybe the uh, old EP Apocalyptic Sickness. Very cool. You guys, uh, yeah, you guys have an upcoming show here pretty soon, correct? Yep, uh, the thirtieth, and it's in Crawfordville. Uh, Crawfordville's not that far. It's only like two hours. Great. <laughs> <Right? laughs> yeah. And yeah. then also Jasper um, is on the eighth. So. Cool. So you can go like down to Jasper, watch Take It In, then go to Holiday World. Good job. <laughs> Two words wisdom. You guys ought to just play Holiday World. That'd be yeah, cool. That would be awesome. That would be actually amazing. going to try and play at the campground there, but um, I don't know if they're the mall. So. <laughs> <laughs> the same reaction as the mall, huh? Yep. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, Rock band, what? Anyway, guys, thanks for stopping by. You guys uh, are definitely more than welcome to come back anytime and uh, talk more about the possums. Yeah, definitely. Uh, we would love to come back and uh, hopefully we can get Jackie in here sometime too uh, yeah, to talk about that new uh, new song with you forever. So let's definitely check that out. Check us out too. And if people want to get a hold of you, what's uh, the best way to get a hold of you? Probably definitely Facebook. Okay, so it's facebook.com slash taken in seven. Number right. seven. Number seven. We'll go ahead and put a link on our Facebook fan page too, so if you guys want to just check out the B97 Facebook fan page, you can check out the Take It In Facebook fan page. Like so. B97. Yes. Totally. Yes. Alright guys, well thanks for stopping out, and uh, thanks for joining us on the show, man. Thanks for having us. Love it. Go. Cool. Thanks. Love you, fans. Oh, dude, you gotta check out this song. It's called I Love McDonald's, and we're gonna play it next right here in the show. Stick around for that one. Okay, guys? Yes. It's the show on B97. Later.